Hey guys, I'd just like to ask if you could like and subscribe and comment on the video with any thoughts you might have had because it goes a long way towards helping support my channel. Thank you. Hello and welcome back to Telltale's The Walking Dead. Uh, so we're going to be continuing on to episode 2, A House Divided. Uh, can I see the other ones? In harm's way. Okay, so I'm still with them. Amid the ruins. Oh. Um. Clem? What the fuck? In episode 5, no going back. So I take it we're heading to whatever... I remember they mentioned some city was supposed to... Wellington, I think it was. Was supposed to be like some safe place. Uh, who the hell is this? But yeah, both these people actually look new. I think about it. Previously on The Walking Dead. Wait, did they get Lita narrate that? <laughs> freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's and she never. I, I'm Mom went to get Bullshit. cigarettes and never came back. What happened to her kid, Let though? God, the, the angle on her falling there looked like she snapped her back in half. I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Same. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? Yeah, I mean, wait, hold on. I, I mentioned the trope previously about like how they always uh, like, yeah, we were forced to make a choice about whether we should try and save this person, and ended up going wrong, and we lost someone for it. And you know how that's just a trope in like all zombie things. It's also a trope where they just sit down and have a moment of. So who'd you lose? What's your story? Which, granted, that's just general... You know, prying into someone's business that ha can happen in any kind of story, but it's just always, like, this really somber tone of, like... Uh, we've all been through a lot. What did you lose? Kind of thing. It's always with a southern twang, too. It's, it's always gotta be with the southern twang, whether it's Walking Dead or not. On my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. It's not even limited to zombie movies, too. Like, uh... Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Quiet Place 2. That dude just seemed like he'd fit in a zombie movie. Whatever his name was, the dude that helped them. Okay, he was a lot more pale than that in the last video. What? The first episode of the game. God damn it! Come this way! Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you! Is he bit? Nick, hold on. Nick. Aim for their fucking heads! What are you God doing? Now, he made a right decision. What's he gonna do? Jump across the river and battle all six of those guys? I swear if they like hold it against each other, it's like, no, we're just trying to survive. Calm down. The walking dead. Also, I need to check how long this this episode's gonna be, because the other one was so short. On the downside, we can't get okay. through them. First one was hour and a half. This one's two hours. Next one's hour and a half, hour and a half, hour and a half. Okay, so they're all just sh on the short side. Okay, I gotta keep that in mind. I, I may shorten these videos a little bit to like 30 minutes instead of 40. Staring ain't polite. What are you going to do? Hand me that there. Shit, man, you can't just do that because you want to. That's. It's worth a shot, I guess. I got nothing to lose, other than my piggly wigglies, of course. 
Hopefully it works. I feel like they tried something like this in the show, maybe, or... Why would you pick so high up? Let's bleed out like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Yes, I will. Just... Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. No, that's not. No, no, he's bit. A lot of stuff Can't just here. give him rest. I'll try to find something to help. Besides, didn't Leecher do the same thing? Yeah, yeah, he did. He did. Where he? Where did I get so much stuff? Oh yeah, because I got my bag back. Water. Anything in that? Not much. Well, I'll give it to him because at least yeah. I know him. Thanks. I'm not giving it some random ass zombie. I'll keep looking around. Oh, Nick, that stupid kid. What? What he? What he do? What did he do wrong? Seriously. He ran away from zombies as if that's a shock. Out of gas. Worth a shot. Let me check this box. Correct there might have another step up front Let's that I can that. check, but let me just check Anything these first. Give me one of those. Frog tastes like pine tar by now, but I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. Go ahead, man. You got a light? Yeah. Tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? We wait. Wait for what? What are we supposed to wait for? What? For him to turn? What? How could you fall asleep in this situation knowing that he's going to turn? Why would you not try to help him do something? Do I just get closer? What? It's a shit in a five pound sack. <coughs> Jesus. Stuck in this can the whole damn day. You want to hear something funny? What? I've been thinking. And I don't want to die. <coughs> then we could have prevented this. <laughs> Fucking swear. I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that, but there it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. Everyone ends up like this. Yeah, you never think it's gonna happen to you. How could you not? What? Would you... Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think. 
He is a good boy. Shit, now I'm gonna have to pick between him and... He's been playing a tough hand, but he is a good boy. I'll do what I can. Thank you. He will remember today, that. Well, he's dying he anyway. It won't us. matter much. Where are you going? I'm not getting out of this. You're gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you some time. Thank you. Thank you, Pete. You go find my nephew now, right? Wait for my signal and run straight to the woods. Just keep moving. All right. Let's get this over with. I don't know why you want to draw them in like this, but okay. Is that the signal? Wait, what? <laughs> Body check! That, that went pretty well. That, that went surprisingly well. Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem! Pete got bit. What? What happened? Walkers. Thank God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there! Get the guns! Wait, where are Luke and Alvin? I assume his name is Alvin. Luke and Alvin, we're Hardly... looking for you. Okay. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's but you upstairs. want me not to do anything. Distract her and don't tell her anything. She gets nervous. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. Shit. And Other people are going to show up. Other people are going to show up. Fuck. Say cheese. <laughs> Caught me. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. <laughs> I'd say it's not to so go looking cool. under there. Take one oh, of thank me. You. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Well, you gotta do a good pose. I mean... Okay, I'm ready. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? He'll be fine. Are you sure? How can I be sure? <laughs> Come on. Sorry, I I, I just need to. <sighs> I genuinely don't know how much she actually knows, but it's probably more than her dad thinks. You want to see what I found? Sure. Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? As long as you don't tell your dad. I won't, I promise. 
First, remember, it's just a thing. What does that mean? Um, I don't know. <laughs> okay, what do I do? The most important thing is, when you go to shoot, take a breath before you pull the trigger. <sighs> Not that big. <sighs> you showed hair shoot? how to defend yourself. Don't put it in! Whoa! S sorry, sorry. Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Nah, let's stay in here. Hey, Luke's back. She's gonna shoot somebody. <laughs> There's no way she's not gonna shoot anybody. We taught Sarah how to defend ourselves, except like every important possible thing there is to, about defending ourselves with a weapon. Why am I sneaking? If Luke's back, Luke's back. That's not Luke. Oh. Well, shit. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Where? Oh. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. What happened? Hello? Hello there. Who are you? Well, actually, I'm your neighbor. Neighbor? That's right. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. Pleasure to meet you. You mind if I come in for a bit? No, you can't just barge your way in. Yes, I do mind. Why am I in charge of the house all of a sudden, actually? This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Just me and, and Dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Strong name. I like him already. Where is he? He's out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. I ain't seen a shit. Of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. I ain't seen him. Big black guy. This big. I haven't seen him. Well, that's a shame. You sure? I am certain. Pretty sure. Why are you just looking through my house? Hey, get a warrant. Get out of here without a warrant. It's a lot of plates for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah, well, I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Just passing through or you been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Just passing through, going north. Whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. And I can't stand that Yankee weather. The cold slows them down. Well, that's not worth the trade, in my opinion. Not worth the trade? What? What? Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. Well, it's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. I know, right? I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. 
but a smart man. What happened to him? Let's just say we had our differences. Sooner or later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Happens every time. That's not a way you want to live. Ah, that's not, well, that's not well, a good mindset. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I don't know. Old house. I thought you said nobody's here. Nobody is here. Nobody is here. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. What's he doing? Who's this? Must be someone who lived here. Must be. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? What's your point? If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? We can trust you gotta you gotta build that. What? Of course I, I you just meet someone for the first well, time. I think I've troubled you long enough. Especially in like let myself really out. weird circumstances. Don't come back. You have a real good day now. I hope he remembers that. Don't come back. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? I didn't hear the door close. I mean, is he gone? We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Yeah, we just stay here. What are we going to do? Uh, Clementine. Sarah. We, we found the others. They told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. He said his name was George. George? That's what he said. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? I genuinely yeah, don't remember. <laughs> he talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. All right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Unbelievable. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving out. Alvin, wait! What, what's up with them? We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. 
Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. Yeah, I believe that. You have to leave. We have to find Pete. We'll get him on the way out, Nick. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Moving out. Let's go. Yeehaw. Now, you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. It's, it's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us. It's a long story. He... He has a hard time letting go. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard... Why are these people just flipping all of a sudden? Everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. Hold on, hold on. I get people might be less trusting than others. I, what's confusing me is how hard Luke and then Nick and now her <laughs> flipped on their hard feelings. Like, nah, just make him an asshole. Don't be like, ah, oh, I'm an asshole. Until I'm not. I'm really sorry. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I was so mean to you. Like, nah, nah. Make it consistent. <laughs> I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Yeah, that would Alan help. And I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Do not Any say Omid or Krista. Clem? Do not say Omid or Krista. Are all the walkers dead? Did he kill them? There. That's where we were. Just cut her off, damn. <laughs> Be careful, man. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Uh, well, we should be careful. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. tiny bit on the short side, but I'm going to go ahead and stop this episode here, and I will see you all next time in Telltale's The Walking Dead. Bye. Thank you for watching. If you liked what you saw, please leave a like and comment, and subscribe to the channel for more content. Thank you.